Ooh, let me change the lighting actually. Okay. Salutations on the Knights of the Buzzfeed Table. My name is Sir Antelot. And, okay. Sorry about that terrible lighting in the intro, but it is currently 4.37. My step, my Eastern Standard Time. And I realized I haven't recorded a video yet today. Well, it's Thursday, but I'm going to be uploading this Friday. I'm just a mess. Anyway. So, for today's video, well... Bobby, lay still, please. Sorry. Bobby's... Bobby's in the room, sorry. So, for today's video, it's going to be a bit different. Here, you want to be up here? Come here, Bobby. Come here, sweetie. Come here. Come here, you're distracting the crap out of me, but I love you still. So. Come here. Don't, don't fall on your back. Come on. She, 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 every time I want, every time I try to pick up Dobby with my hand, she always flops. <laughs> See, it's just kind of nice. Here, here, look at the camera. Look at the camera. Hey, guys. Oh. It's like ever getting too close to your face. So, yeah. For those who remember Dobby from about a few months ago in, like, jeez, that was like August. Dobby is my little Chewini, and she is my baby. And, uh, for those who don't like it, there's a door. Leave. So yeah. So Dobby, I'm actually glad you're here. So, I know you can't have these because it's chocolate, but we are gonna, for, oh yeah, back to the base, I, I, I almost got sidetracked, but for today's video, I'm actually gonna be trying, stop sniffing the Xbox, please. <laughs> you're a good girl. Anyway, so for today's video, well, as most, as most people who know, who watch HBO, the final season of Game of Thrones has just started. And, well, personally, I haven't really watched that show. I mean, this is coming from the... This is also coming from the... Or is it AMC? I don't know. I'm getting confused now. Anyway, so for today's video, it was... I, I basically saw these at the store, and I thought they looked so freaking cool. I just had to show you guys. And review them. And they are Game of Thrones or... Bad time to get hiccups, Bobby. Oreos. Game of Thrones Oreos. I mean, like... Okay. Gotta lay down now, sweetie. Jump on the bed, okay? Jump on the bed. Okay. So, here we have Game of Thrones Oreos. Like, first off, can we just appreciate the packaging real quick? It's not even a... Sh it's like a matte black. Like, when I first saw this, I was like, whoa! The li it looks so different. Like, I wish they would... About time... <laughs> Oreo did something different than the shiny blue. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like a shiny blue. I mean, have you seen my room? I like blue everything. But, honestly, I like, I actually like this. Like, I mean, I'm not the, I'm not the guy who, like, she likes the two likes change. Not the, but, not change as in money, but change as in, a change of topic or a change of subject or change of revenue. Gabby, what are you doing? She's rolling around. She's distracting the crap out of me. But... Game of Thrones Oreos, like, get a get a good look at that. Like, holy crap. I don't know if you guys can see that all the way, but yeah. Oh, and, uh... You guys help tell me in the comments what these symbols mean, but here's the back. It shows upside down. Well, the packaging's upside down, but that's right side up, anyway. But this shows all the care, all the, like, who will, who will sit on the Iron Throne, I guess, kind of clans? I'm not sure. I've never watched Game of Thrones. I admit it. I know there's Lannisters, uh, uh, Targaryens, uh, um, White Walkers, and I, that's all I know. All I know is that three, there's the Lannisters, the Targaryens, the White Walkers, and the uh, fourth clan I Anyway, so I gotta review these. Like, I gotta see how they look. And thankfully, it says lift right here, so it's not one of those bull crap packagings that says like tear here. No, it gives you the lift option. That way, I mean, you can lift. You can lift. Uh, don't spill these. Open them up and reseal them. Now, this is way better packaged packaged than those love Oreos I tried. I tried a few months ago for like Valentine's Day. Do, do you all remember those? Like. 
they 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 messed up that packaging, big time. But let's pull one out and see what we get. Ooh, I think I got a White Walker. All right, I'm gonna try four of these Oreos and see. I'm gonna try four Oreos. I mean, I bet they're just original Oreos, so who knows? Let me just try to pull out four designs that are different. Ah, what did you look at that? I actually did it. Nailed it. First try. Seal those back up. Now, now, I don't know what the logos are. I probably should have looked them up first, but. I gotta admit, I know one of them. I mean, I know one of them. Like, I think this is... Let me get my face out of there. I think this is the White Walkers. I Don't take my word on that, though. Like, it's just a human face. I mean, I'm just bullcrapping here, okay? So, I mean, my guess is that they taste like regular Oreos. I mean, let's be real here. Yeah, just the same Oreo. But a different texture, I have to admit. I have to admit, the one cookie that shows the design is a different texture. Like, it's smooth. Imagine an Oreo, but without all the details. So the flip side, basically. This is a regular Oreo, though. Excuse my spit. I just spat everywhere. That's embarrassing. Now, Dobby, I'm going to offer you one of these, but you can't have chocolate, because that's poison, okay? She is eyeballing the crap out of this cookie. Oh, whoa. Hmm. They're good, though. Different texture, but I like it. It's a good texture. Excuse me while I eat my mouthful. Or talk with my mouthful. What? Alright. I meant to grab a glass of milk, by the way. Like, I kind of failed a little bit. I forgot a glass of milk, but then again, I just got out of the shower and my hair is still drying a little bit. But I, I was, like, I got out of the shower and I realized, oh, jeez, I need to make a video. You know, a pro Jared moment. That was mean. I am apologizing. <laughs> that was so mean. I'm so sorry. If you think about it, pro Jared hasn't uploaded in about three months on his main channel. Like, I'll shut up now. So, yeah. I'm not gonna eat the rest of the cookies because I'll eat them later off camera, but I don't wanna like spend an entire day being, I don't wanna make a mukbang because that's that that's content for another video. Right now I'm just reviewing them. So looks like we have a three headed dragon. I'm not sure what you would call this, but let me get you a good gander of that. Pretty cool. And we also have a my guess, a fire-breathing dragon? No, lion? Of course. I'm gonna guess a fire-breathing lion. I honestly can't tell. I mean, the design's there, but I don't know what the animal is. And then, of course, we have a wolf. Got it in a minute. Pretty cool. Now, I would eat the rest of these, but I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna eat them off camera. I already said that. My bad. So... What's my thoughts? My thoughts on these Oreos. I mean, the Game of Thrones Oreos, I'm just gonna give my final thoughts right now. I gotta admit, the packaging is like amazing. Like, it shows the text, it shows like what the, the or it shows, an, I forgot to mention this, but it shows like a matte black, has the words Oreos in the Game of Thrones font, has the names of the clans, uh, kingdoms, and it shows an Oreo on the iron. Freaking throne. That's about, that's about all I know about or about Game of Thrones. That's the font and that's the Iron Throne. That's all I know. I think my, I think my little sister's boyfriend just walked in the door. But anyway, but the packaging, 10 out of 10. Like they get it, they got it. Like Oreo, perfect packaging. But the cookies, I wish they would have done something a different flavor. I mean, I mean, I am an Oreo fanatic. I'm about as obsessed as Lamar Wilson at like with his Oreos. Of course, you move them to all the Instagram, but anyway. But yeah, I mean, packaging, 10 out of 10, but I kind of wish they were a different flavor. Different flavor. I mean, if you're a Game of Thrones fan, I mean, sure, you can get this as a novelty item, but if you're not a Game of Thrones fan, 
I guess you're just better off with a regular pack of Oreos. I mean, it's it's the same taste, but a different texture. So, but since it's Game of Thrones related, I have to admit, in terms of in terms of being a Game of Thrones fan, Oreo, Game of Thrones themed. Oh, well, let me rephrase that. Game of Thrones Oreos is definitely a hit for this month. A hit for the Oreo flavor this this time. I mean, we've had some flops in the past, looking at you, love Oreos and dark chocolate Oreos, but Oreos are Oreo, Oreos, are Oreos, and I mean, packaging is great, taste, wish it was different, and the texture, it's different, but a good different. So, yeah, stamp of approval. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me just trying and reviewing the Game of Thrones Oreos. If you did, Dabby, I'm trying to do my outro, sweetie. If you did... Drop a like like you're dropping the bass. Wah, wah. And give you a subscribe button, you'll smizzity smack. And I'll see you for the night in the next video. Wanna say goodbye, Dobby? Come here, Dobby. Come here, Dobby. Say goodbye, fellow knights. Say goodbye, Dobby. Goodbye, Dobby. It's more Alec. <sighs> anyway. <sighs> Alright. Help me say toods. Toods. <laughs> Alright. You're, you're, you're impossible to work with. Dudes.